everyone, welcome back to On the Workbench. Today we're taking a look at the two-piece wide tip radiator hose pick set from Snap-on, model SGA102B, followed by a color code of R for red. You can also get O for orange or G for green, so on and so forth with your various Snap-on colors. And so this was a set I picked up recently due to it having the wider spoon type tip. As you can see from looking at the packaging here, it comes with a tray to hold it. I'm probably going to get rid of the tray because I'm not really into the whole storage trays. They take up a lot more space than they're worth in my toolbox. Coming on to the back side here, a couple important details in the lower left corner there, made in USA. Always a good sign. That makes me happy. We got the instinct grip here on the tool handle. And a couple of the big things here with these specifically is the wide tip of the blades on the ends of these for pulling off radiator hoses or other hoses in your car. So let's go ahead and open this up and take it out of the packaging here and see what we get. And so now with the, with the wrapping undone, we've got our traditional snap-on instinct grip handle that has basically three sides on it. If we look at the end of the cap, it just says USA at the end. It doesn't actually have a symbol. We'll look at the other one, again, just USA. It'd be nice if there was a symbol on the end that somehow denoted exactly what this was, but generally you're probably not gonna store it, which is the grip sticking up in your toolbox. So now if we look at the business end of the tool here, you can see there's this wide, flat tip to help avoid poking holes in hoses. And so a couple things here. So there's this type here, it's got the hook, which is basically a pull. And then you've got the other type here. It's the same type of blade here, it's kind of a push. As a spoon, so you got basically a push and a pull. These are the only lengths that this is available in. And the only difference is the colors that you can get with it for the handle colors. But the length, if we go from the top of the bend to the handle here is eight inches. And then on the short run from the tip to the grip is five inches. Um, this tip here is flat. It would be nice if this had a little bit of a curvature to it just because all the hoses obviously are gonna have some curve to it. So rather than being flat, it'd be nice if that were actually had some, a little bit, I guess, uh, either convex or concave, depending on what side of the tool we're looking at, if it had that on it. And I'd also prefer if they had uh, these in, maybe with a 45 degree angle bend on it. So think about trying to access some of those lower radiator hoses uh, can be kind of a pain for the amount of space that you've got. And I could see one with a little bit, maybe a 45, or some other angle actually added in here uh, might help add some accessibility if you have these at some different angles. And so just to juxtapose this, here's my other pick here. You can get some snap-on variants of this. This is an old Craftsman Professional. Works great. This has the uh, more traditional style pointed tip. And I've never actually pierced a hose, but it's not hard to see how that could happen with this narrow pointed tip. So just by comparison, if you can see the significant difference in the widths there between the two, so I put my finger there behind it to hopefully make it easier to see. Uh, this is definitely wider, and let's put the tape measure to it. And if we look at the width of this, it comes in right about a quarter inch wide. And it should be the same on the other one, checking in also at quarter inch. And so the, the, the set of two, I wanna say runs about 60, $65. It's definitely not cheap, but the idea of actually piercing a radiator hose when you're working on it could cost you way more than 60 bucks. And so I think it's worth it. Uh, even as someone who is, you know, works out of their own garage at home, and I'm not a professional mechanic, but just the amount of savings and trying to track down the proper radiator hose, that this is definitely 60 bucks well invested uh, for dealing with hoses. You could also use these with vacuum hoses and the like. Again, uh, I think my only complaint is I wish there was actually not, you could get these with an extra bend or some other lengths rather than just a couple variants. It's not hard to believe that Snap-on might eventually come out with that. I would expect them to, just like you can get uh, pick sets like these in all sorts of different head angles. I would expect that with the demand of these being strong enough, we'll eventually get some extra uh, business and geometries. But for now, they've got the push and the pull. And that should probably cover 90 to 95% of all my needs and most other people's needs, I think. And I suppose you can always get out your vise uh, and bend it accordingly. Don't think it'd be warranty. These do normally come with a lifetime snap-on warranty. 
that your Snap-on dealer uh, should be able to warranty these out. And I would imagine you could just pull these right out of these Instinct grips. I can't believe these would be any different than some of the screwdriver grips, and they could just pull out, just like if you've ever seen a Snap-on screwdriver get warrantied, the guy would just pull the blade out and save the handle and give you the same handle back. I would anticipate it to be the same uh, with these uh, wide tip radiator hose picks. So this is my look at these. I hope you found this video useful and interesting. If you had any successes or failures with these, please put in the comments below. I appreciate your feedback and pass on that thumbs up and have a great day. Bye.